Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. We're going to make part right now. We're going to go ahead and make part number five, the rudder. So first thing we're going to do is get a head on over to Onshape, and we've got our model here. Take a look. So we're going to make that rudder right there. Uh, this can be a pretty easy part. It's just a quadrilateral, and so we're going to come in and click Sketch. You know, a little plane. Just roughly sketch out your quadrilateral, applying the horizontal constraint to the top, vertical constraint to the back, and then let's make sure we only apply a constraint here, and there you go. So that's it for the rudder. That's the starboard rudder. Well, it's a, they're the same. That's the starboard rudder. That's the starboard rudder, and we'll put it on the face of the extrusion. So we're going to come ahead here and check our measurements. So what do we have for measurements? We have a height of uh, 1.123. And 80,000, so 1.1.380. 1. So let's go ahead and click that height of 1.380. 1. 1.380. 1. The top of the quadrilateral is 0. 0.533. Point five three three, and then the bottom of the rectangle overall width is eight hundred and eighty five thousandths. Connect the two dots, eight hundred eighty five thousandths. There you have it. So now we're done with the sketch for the starboard rudder. It's just a matter of extruding that rudder sketch. So just click starboard rudder here. And how far do we, do, do we extrude that? We extrude the thickness of 100, so 0 0.1, so 182 thousandths. So 0.182. This is a new part, which is going to be the starboard rudder. Do the same thing for the port rudder and go on to the next part. Good job. Keep focusing. Keep being awesome.